the staffing industry is not a sexy industry. Nobody goes to college and says, I'm going to run a staffing company. But corporations will always need people, will always need talent. Pinnacle Technical Resources provides technology, IT contractors, to the Fortune 500. I started Pinnacle in 1996 for my apartment floor. I was young and single and very confident. My parents were in the travel industry. My sister and I were full-fledged travel agents by 15. And literally, we'd call the airlines and make the reservation. Everything was manual. One day, my father brought a computer to the business, and I was fascinated. I didn't have to stay on hold <laughs> for an hour, and so I could easily log into a computer and make a reservation. In and around the travel industry, there was a lot of robberies. You know, uh, that's how I lost my father. Uh, he was at the agency by himself, and, um, you know, a thief came in that day. And um, I don't even think they meant to kill him. By the time um, we got to the hospital, my family was devastated, absolutely devastated. I learned every day that that is not the life that I want. And so I begged my mother to go to college. And my mother said, OK, under one condition, you stay close to home. And so we sold the business, and we moved to Texas. My interest in technology never faltered. My first job out of college was with uh, none other than a technology firm in New York City. I, I would have stayed with the company forever, but the reality is I miss my family. Uh, we were married in 97. And I married my best friend's big brother. The company, quite frankly, was doing fantastic. Uh, the marketplace was looking for IT talent. Then 9-11 hit, and uh, our country was devastated, and so was our industry. Uh, we had come down to a liquidation plan, and you know all the consultants told me that it was time to, um, to wrap it up. Nobody's purchasing what you have to sell. You have to reinvent yourself. So I visited one-on-one -on -one all my customers. If they're not buying contract labor, what are they buying? They were buying projects, fixed price, deliverable-based IT solutions. And then 2 million to 4 million, and 4 million to 10 million, 10 million to 40, and 40 to 140, and the rest is history. So we've come a long way from a living room floor. And where is Pinnacle going? We have set the proverbial stake on the ground, and we're going to a billion dollars in revenue. We have all the right people to do it, all the right momentum, and all the right clientele. My father instilled an incredible level of confidence, not arrogance, confidence, and a dose of humility. 
that I think really made me who I am today. And I think he knew back then that there was a lot that I could accomplish.